Hi there, my name is Dan and this is a free extract from my larger InDesign course on my website bringyourownlaptop.com Alright, I've just opened a file, it's an older file that I've been working on and it come up with this thing that says converted and then I try and save it and it says I gotta do a save as, it won't let me save it over the top of the thing I just opened. Why is that? It's because InDesign is updated between when you created this file and where it is now. It might only be six months ago, it might even be two months ago. And there is nothing we can do about it, so we just have to live with it. We just go file, save, and just give it the same name, okay? And it'll say, would you like to replace? And you say, maybe. What you might do before you go and replace it over the top, I'm pretty confident. I always do it and I never had a problem. I do not want to get you into that problem. I'd like you to go off, make a copy of it somewhere, stick it somewhere hidden in case this all goes horribly wrong for you. At least you can go back to that original. For me, I always replace it with the same name and I don't have any problems. It's just upgrading it to a newer version of InDesign. We just have to live with it. And that is all. Let's get on to the next video. So, what did you think? Did you like it? Okay, if you did, please hit the like button and maybe consider subscribing to my channel. It really helps my business. Now, this is just a free video from my larger InDesign course. You can see the full version on bringyourownlaptop.com. Uh, on that site, there is a free cheat sheet you can download. Okay, print it off. Stick it next to your computer, look awesome. The other thing is, is I have lots of other courses there. Photoshop, Illustrator, InDesign, After Effects, Premiere, Dreamweaver, lots of other ones. So go check that out on bringyourownlaptop.com. Bye.